Hey guys, this is Wideband39. Please don't get mad at me, but I realized when I was looking on my guide website, PropTropicaGuides.webs.com, that I screwed up a little bit. Uh, not with anything else, but I s told you some false information. Um, so, we're going to have to do something, but don't worry, you'll, we'll be okay. So, push the soap down and then walk on this, so that walk right on it until you can't walk right anymore then fall down and push this soap up until about here once you're here you can jump on the duck and jump off here now here's where I went wrong Yesterday I was looking on my guide just to refresh my memory on how to beat the island and I remembered that when you do this it says you have to back it up. Now I know in earlier episodes, I think it was last episode, I said that because we backed it up earlier we had we were we would be able to skip this, but apparently not. So let's go back to the computer and I'll meet you there. Okay, so we're at the computer. So apparently you have to back it up. And we enter it in. Yeah, I'm sorry about that, guys. Don't do, if you didn't do... Uh, let's re restart that. Um, if you didn't already finish this island, uh, just skip the part in my video where I backed it up. I can't change it now that it's like on YouTube. So, um, yeah, just, you know, skip that part. I mean, it's not a huge deal, but it's a little annoying knowing that I have to go all the way back now. By the way, I didn't cut the camera on only because, you know, I don't have to right now. So let's finish the episode as we tried to start it uh, before and in the normal way. So, I'm going to try to get it done in the ne this next episode. I mean, there's not much left to do, honestly. So, okay, so let's do what we did before. Just hit the button and jump in the steam. Oh, no. I don't want to have to do this again. Come on. <sighs> All right, so, guys... I've seen that you probably like this video. I can agree with you. I really like this uh, mindset of doing any random island because right now we would be doing the booty and I can't really make too many jokes about that. So, oh wow, it saved. Okay, so it saved where we are, so that that saved us a little time at least. You know, I want to have time with you guys. I want to make so many videos and post them on YouTube so you guys enjoy. I mean, I'm not doing it for fame. I really honestly want to have fun with you guys. And it's, uh, I mean that in the best way possible. So, I hit use and it drops in the toilet. And it says I need to flush this fast. So, all you have to do is jump on the toilet paper, rotten and soiled and then jump here it will flush with the gigantic earthquake of awesomeness and then that thief will come back and it said drat where did she hide, hide the thumb drive and now you're gonna have to go back to the telescope so I'll meet you there alright I'm on the telescope and I set my coordinates already you should probably do that by the way the only way you could have gotten here if you is if you redid the thermostat. I'm sorry I forgot to mention that because I forgot again. All right, so you're gonna have another one of these um, Morse code messages, and I'll show you the letters because you could see the, those. I know that. So it's T H I E, and you're probably wondering what it's gonna spell out. I'll I'll tell you in a second because it will tell you thief. is 
I hope it doesn't say mom. My mom's not a thief. Mr. CJ? No. It says Mr. Silva. The science teacher is the is the person who stole the shrink ray and shrunk me down. So it's time to take him down. And now watch in the background. There's Mr. Silva, all gigantic. So CJ's in trouble and we have to save her. And that's exactly what I just said two seconds ago. Anyway, here's a really cool um, part of this island, and I love it. It's so fun. Now, here's what we're going to do. Uh, the reason you picked up that remote control is for a very important reason, obviously to save CJ. But you say you have to get out of the house somehow with a remote-controlled car and save CJ that way. But there's absolutely no way you can do that. You think. So, I'm sorry, I walked too far. Um, I forgot here. Just jump on the shelves and keep jumping up. Jump on all the awards and all this stuff. Jump on the plant. Okay. Push this Tess's tree book. It's going to take a little bit of movement, but after you push it down, you'll see in a second why it's needed. So, just fall down and see it for a second. It's a ramp. And remember, you're small, so this whole place is thinks uh, you think it looks big. It's actually pretty small. So let's go right and do something really awesome. Jump over the cat. Yeah. Okay. And I am ready to make the great escape to find CJ. Okay. Pick up the battery from the m remote again. I didn't I forgot to do that before, but now we have the battery again. And we're not even going 3 feet away again cuz we're going to put it back in this car. Let's go use the battery and drive the car. Now, you control the car with your normal Pop Tropican controls. So, just move it left. It goes a lot faster than anything else does. The cat doesn't lash out, don't worry. Oh, whoop, sorry. Go left, don't get out. That that was my mistake. Okay, here's the cool part. Go left. And once you hit the ramp, it will load. We are now on the great CJ chase. Okay, so you're in this car now, and you're driving, trying to get across to the school. Now, it takes a little bit of driving, but and don't hit many objects. I mean, it's almost impossible not to hit any, to swerve around, but because you're, one, a toy car. Two, it's because there are a lot of obstacles that you have to face here. So, just be careful. By the way, we probably are going to be able to do this in three episodes. So, let's go! Oh, Jesus. Okay. Come on, come on. We can do this. Yeah. Oh god. Yeah, it takes a lot of swerving around. Whoa. Okay, cool. Come on, hopefully this is close to school. Jesus! No! Come on, car, I know you can do it! Here! Yeah! 
just to let you know, I'm going to cut the camera as soon as I get to the school, because I don't know how much time this is going to take. Whoa! I seem to be getting closer. The harder it is, by the way, the closer you are to the school. Yep, here we go. So, I'm on, and I'm going to meet you inside the school. Alright, guys, here we go. So, we're going to run left, and we're going to talk to CJ. We're going to say, what should we do? And this is when Silva comes. She explains that we have to go before Silva sees us. And then, through all this dialogue, Silva, Silva explains that uh, he, he's going to shrink us down until we can't see like anything anymore. So we're like basically a speck of dust. So we have to run so that doesn't happen. Uh, so, here's how the boss battle works. We have to hide behind m random miscellaneous objects and somehow stop Mr. Silva. So, I usually run behind the backpack first because the shrink ray comes pretty fast. And then the other ones are easier, I guess. You should somehow get to the quartz and jump up and walk right, well run right, into the globe and it's okay if you're shown a little bit on the globe because um, okay so you're gonna push a little bit and hide behind this okay so you're gonna just jump on the globe and jump on here and jump on here and hide behind the cup okay so next your next move is here behind the mirror and you probably like the mirror huh and you're probably right so you walk a little to the left until it beams back at Mr. Silva and now he's in the ant farm. So now Mr. Silva's shrinking down and yeah. Okay, so there's only a l couple small little things you have to do now. And he says, let me out of here! Now CJ suggests that we uh, grow back again, which is a very good suggestion. So, she says she also has a good idea for a new science project. So all you have to do is click on the lever, and we are going to grow back to full size. Yes, guys, we are going to do it! Ha ha! Alright, so it starts to load and all that. And the new science project is the Incredible Shrunken Man. So you see Silva here, and the shrink ray gun. And... Yeah, so... Now you get the Island Medallion. Awesome. Alright, so you're probably wondering now, where am I going next? The next island, guys, is Cryptids Island. Yes, Cryptids. So, I'm out of time. So, this is WiredBand39, rate, comment, subscribe, tell me how you like this video, and tell me how you were helped with this walkthrough. Alright, this is WiredBand39, signing out.